Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica. If you're new here, welcome. I am so happy to have you. So today's video is comparing two really popular mascaras by Lancome. The first one is the Lancome Idole, and then the other one is the Monsieur Big. So I'm gonna go ahead and compare and contrast them for you, one on each eye. So depending upon what you're looking for in a mascara, you can pick which one is best for you. Um, before I do so though, all of the makeup and the shirt that I'm wearing will be linked down below. But if you are my follower who was following me on my last Clinique video, um, I just wanted to tell you that I did go ahead and buy the lighter shade for fall and winter, and it is the CN28, and it is a perfect shade match, and it's what I'm wearing, because um, I've absolutely been loving and wearing this foundation on a daily basis. So the first thing I'm gonna do is curl my lashes, because that is something that I always do. I will also, if I didn't say I'll link my makeup, I will do that as well. So let's go ahead and curl them. And then I am going to put the same base on, which is the Lancome base. Really like this primer. It does a really great job holding mascara on. The other one, if you do not like this price point that's very similar, is the L'Oreal Paradise um, one as well. I'll put that one down below too. That is also a really great primer. But since I was doing Lancome, I thought I would just stick with everything in Lancome for my eyes. Okay, so on this side, I'm going to put the Idole, and on this side, I'm going to put the Monsieur Big, so that way you can see how they look and decide which one is for you. And then I'll let you know my thoughts. So for the Lancome Idole, I'm gonna go ahead and I'll do one coat at a time. I just go ahead at the base and I wiggle it on up. But as you can see, this one gives very clean lines. And it does a really great job of lengthening. Okay, so on this side, I'm going to do the Monsieur Big and do the same thing. I'm gonna put one coat, just wiggling it on up. All right, so here's the difference between the one coat on each. This one, is very long, lengthened, there's no clumps, it's very streamlined. This one is very lengthened, it's more bold, um, and this one does tend to get a little bit of clumps, um, but it definitely does a more bold look. So I'm gonna add some more so that you can see that. All right, so let's go ahead and do another coat. So here's two coats of the idly. Sorry if I'm saying it wrong. So there's two coats. And let's go ahead and do the Monsieur Big with two coats. And this is where you will start to get the clumpiness of when you do more than one coat with the Monsieur Big. And sometimes it takes a little bit more to separate your lashes. So here's two. If you look, I definitely feel like this side is much more bold, but it is a little harder to work with because you will start to get those clumps and you will have to like play with it if you want them to be evenly like divided and separated. Um, it's a little harder to do. Whereas the Lancome Idole one is very streamlined. I don't have any problem with clumping no matter how many coats that I add to it. Um, I will show you the difference in the bristles. So in the Idole one, this is the bristle, okay? And then in the Monsieur Big one, the bristles are very different. They are very fluffy. All right, my other two thoughts before I leave you between these two mascaras is I love them both, but I love them both for different reasons. I love that this one gives a lot of volume and a lot of boldness. I love that this one gives a lot of volume and that I love that it's very streamlined and my eyelashes, I can add lots of coats and not have any problems with clumping. Which one would I pick? I like the Idole because I've never had a problem with it smearing or causing any raccoon eyes. Um, if my eyes water from allergies, this one doesn't budge. This one, however, it looks beautiful, um, but during the day I found when I wore it to work, if my eyes were watery or anything like that, I would start to have a little bit of a transfer where it would show raccoon eyes. So that is my final thought on these two mascaras, but depending upon what you're looking for, you might think differently. So I thank you so much for watching. I love for you to subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.